Hello everybody, welcome back to another episode of Supermarket Simulator. When we last left off, we got our second, third level 81 license. We only have two licenses left, I believe. Um, so without further ado, let's jump back in. Hi right, guys. They're doing the thing. Earlier, so I went through and refilled the storage room like I usually do. And earlier, I was trying to fill in the cheese, and instead of, I was clicking the button to put things in. There's only two buttons, right, for placing things. Um, and it was taking them out, and I couldn't put them in, I could only take them out. And then, like, one of the guys came over to fill it up, and it went into my box. So that's what we've got on the docket today. <laughs> Glitch City. <laughs> I did just restart the game, just in case, because there's no telling. I'm going to try to remember to do it between each day, because if I don't, then I probably won't do anything. I'm just going to go ahead and preemptively put away the problematic box there. Oh, maybe I need to turn on the light. Let's see, open. Yeah. I also tried to go through... I didn't really... I was thinking about going through and filling up each shelf. That should definitely help our restockers. Because, like, as soon as somebody takes one of these uh, packages of beer, like, they're going to want to come out and refill it. Um, so I tried to do a little bit of that on some of the bigger things that are more important. And then I went through and cleaned out, like, I had, like, I want to say it was one of these cheeses. I had, like, five boxes but I only had like six cheeses. So I went through and cleaned up a lot of that mess in here where it was just a bunch of like boxes with like one or two, one to four items in it, um, which also doesn't help with our restockers efficiency because if they're only coming out to put in one item on the shelf instead of refilling the whole shelf, obviously that's gonna take up time. So we shall see. I think I've got, I've checked, double checked, but I think I have everything that I need back here. Oh, he's probably refilling the whiskey already, I guess. That guy only took three whiskeys. It's a bit, a bit excessive, but I'll allow it. Okay. It's like watery. It hasn't been watery all day. It's just been like really humid here. Although I started my morning by having to choose. Oh, I love this one. Um. Between whether or not I was going to walk by a guy mowing the dead grass. Because whenever you mow that excessively, uh, the grass just dies. But uh, he was mowing the dead grass, uh, the building at work. Or the guy painting the building at work. I had to walk under that. And of course I was wearing a uh, white shirt today. So it's like, okay, I can't really start my morning by getting paint on me. It was really tempting though. It was really tempting to just walk under the paint guy. Because... That's the side of the building that, one, my office is on, and two, I parked on. Um, but instead, I chose to walk all the way to the front of the building from the back of the lot and walk by the lawnmower, so then my eyes are just been watery all day. Because I'm pretty sure I'm allergic to grass. Okay, I'm going to need you all to buy a lot more stuff because I need money. I mean, thank you for giving our restockers a break, but we still need the money, okay? I know you guys are trying to be nice. I need to keep an eye on these. We have not been able to keep these in stock. Everybody wants paper towels. It's probably because we need another brand of paper towel, but... Okay. We need money. Our current threshold to... Why did I do that? To getting the next license is, of course, once again, money. Um, and then the one after that. I have a feeling we'll hit level 91 very either very closely after we get the last level 81 license or uh before so yeah we've only got one more left and then we have to get sixty five thousand dollars yikes managing a grocery store is so hard who knew who knew oh i forgot Thank you. Have a nice day, Miss Blue. 
just go and... Oh, I didn't check. I definitely set prices at the end, right? I wouldn't have not. I think it's the... Based on what was out there whenever I... Oh, these are so hard to set. Yep. Yep, 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 yep. I wonder if I should just do... To kind of help with both our restocker issue and our money issue, if I should just mark everything up by like... 15 cents or something. Or 50 cents even. Just because... People buying less, but at a higher value... Might ultimately be the best. Like if we continuously have issues with them restocking... That might be the way the way to go, because, you know, supply and demand and all that. If our demand is too high for how much we can um, supply, then we must jack up prices. That's what capitalism says, anyway. And who are we if not capitalists in this in this grocery store? Definitely on the... Oh, it would be real nice if people bought less books. Just love the speed up. Beeps. Then the only things that are um, at market value are things that we have a lot of. Uh, get really gross really fast. I'm willing to run at least one day like that, but it would take a lot of going through and setting prices times, so I don't know if we want to do that. We'll see. We'll see how it goes. If we have another day where it's like 14 people couldn't find what they needed, then possibly. Again, I think it's just making sure that our boxes in the back are full and our shelves are full, so that our efficiency is the highest it possibly can be. Honestly, I should probably get rid of a register and just help the restockers. Because at this point, that's where I'm more useful. Oops, sorry, boys. Uh, he's got salt, okay. We'll do cleaner. Nope, can't put things on shelves today. I even restarted! I don't know why. Let me go double check that none of my restarters are stuck. Okay, good. You say I only see two. Okay, they are working. Sorry to keep you waiting, sir. Actually, I don't think he was. That's what I'm talking about. She wouldn't buy four bags of that coffee if it was at a higher price. I wonder how much it would drop our customers. Why are customers never complaining about the prices being cheap, eh? Like, man, this is so cheap, it's practically a scam. Uh, blah, 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 60. Sorry, mathing wasn't mathing. It was like 25, 25 by the 60. <laughs> yeah, I probably couldn't find surprise book.
There's also the idea that I want to get more shelves. Maybe instead of the next thing we do, we get uh, more space. Because I kind of do want more shelves of some things. Like, I want two shelf spaces for each of the books. Um, I want two shelf spaces for... Uh, oh, wait, I already have that. Um, for each of these things, because these all have one, and I think that's problematic. Um, maybe each of these things as well. Just some things that would really help us out, like our sugar aisle could definitely have two of everything. This looks fine. Um, tea I don't really think we need. We could go back to having two of these. Just stuff like that. I think that would help us out a little bit. I don't know about fridge space. Then again, like, I don't really want to do a whole nother remodel before I get the next two licenses, because there's only two. And, like, I want to do one big, like, final, like, this is the, the full remodel of everything in the store, you know? For now, I just kind of got to make things work. But I do think the books is the thing that we are struggling with the most, not having uh, multiple slots of, because there's only eight of them. That's pretty rough. Most things that I only have eight of, I have multiple shelves of. So, that's the end of the day. Okay. Crocs not found and 101. Okay, that's not too bad. Croc and Elo rice. Okay, I think I'm gonna set. I think I'm gonna set all the books fifty cents higher than the market value. Just because it's such a premium to keep them in stock here. These are so hard to do. And it's a premium to buy them too, honestly. Uh. Just increasing things by 50 cents. Some things I don't think they care if they're like a bit higher over, so it's also finding that happy place. Um, dollars. Which I haven't really spent a whole lot of time market researching, you know? Oh, I, I think it was rice. It's like, what was the other thing? Distracted by the books. All of the books are going up in price, boys. Don't worry. I'll pay your paycheck somehow. Uh, what was that before? This was nine for uh Those are all set. I think it was rice. Uh, here. Ugh. Hmm. I'm tempted to just like mark up some stuff. We'll see. We'll see how we go with the books. And we'll just kind of like. Uh. Do it that way. We'll do sections of stuff to kind of see how people respond to it. Because I really do think they're willing to spend more money on different things. I just have a, like, easy, this is how I set things rule. Okay. Um, bills. Bills here. Oh. Huh. This main bucket's fine. Oh yeah, we had to get rid of the ghost bucket. That's right. That's right. I was also thinking of expanding the pasta storage. We get more box of pasta back here, but... Oh yeah, I need to get that stuff. Uh... Just redo it. Um... What is it? Elo rice? Let's get ten of those. And book, book. 
Okay, these are expensive. I saw you. He tried, he tried. Do I have red pop out here? Oh, I do. I have all of them. Oh, I don't have water now. Or the uh, last water. I guess I don't have all the pops either, right? One, two, three, four, five, six. I think I'm missing Turgo. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, yeah. I need one water and one pop. Um, where can I put one of these? Because I could do it with this. Although that's only three slots. No, I can't do it. Hmm. I don't know. I just like having them around the store as like decoration, essentially. Um, it also makes sense that they would be like right here at the front because you would just like buy go here and then go to the register and leave, you know? But one here. Kind of in the walkway. Or like here, but that's definitely in the walkway. I like don't love this freezer section, but I don't hate it. I still think we should ultimately move it there, but fix this real quick. I mean, I might as well do this since I'm generally waiting on them anyway. Because... Thanks for efficiency. Okay, all of the bleach. We need so much bleach. See what I'm talking about? There's like one day where it'll be like insane amount of people bought paper towels and then the next day it's like nobody bought paper towels today. Wait, 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 wait. No. Ugh. You bastard. Pasta penne. One penne. Just did it again. I see blue box and I'm like, yeah, that's the right one. That's the pasta I'm looking for. You know what I always like glance over but never actually look at the numbers? The chicken legs. Almost forgot to order those yesterday. Oh no. I'm the first. Oh my gosh, a second one. Bought two things I didn't need. <laughs> you can see I was a dum dum and threw boxes everywhere. Elastic dum dumery. Uh, I don't think I ordered this stuff. No. It's okay. Three things I wasn't supposed to order. I think I missed those last two throws. A broken box? For real? It's the elbows. It's always the elbows. Imagine if you could have like a delivery chute. And then you can decide like where to put it in your storage and then that's where they like the deliveries come in but it's just like a long tube so you have to get the things out of the front of it put it away before you can get to the things at the back that way there's still some kind of challenge to it i mean i guess you just stand at the tube and pull things out but how about two extra spaghetti Guys, I'm so good at this game. Look at all these extra things I bought. All five of these. Do you guys like my pep talk last time? I was watching ya. Sorry, I threw your box over there. I thought it was helping, but ultimately I feel like I just wasted more time. Alright, boys, get out here. Hmm. Uh. Oh, a few people walking around, but let's start the day. Let's see the lights are right now. All right, boys, get it together. We need to have another good day like we had yesterday, um, and we need to make a lot of money, so. Welcome, ma'am. Yeah, we're just having team meeting out here. Just go ahead. Uh, it's red day, apparently. Suspicious. <clears throat> Oh, uh, you guys forgot this. So 
any others that I just like kind of thrown over here? He threw it away though. Steve, Daryl, Craig, Damien, you good? In my hiding spot. How will they know? I should use buy some like furniture. I need another pe another shelf to go here. I think I'm just gonna go ahead and buy it. Uh, yeah, it's probably fine. That should not fit. Oh, come on. I mean, that one fits, right? I feel like if that one fits... Future home of that shelf. Keep an eye on these books and see if anybody complains. See, I think selling them at a higher value is going to be good because they're already refilling books. And those are 50 cents more than they were yesterday. She doesn't care. He doesn't care. He really doesn't care. They are so good at their job. I chip you have changed and I apologize. I was like, I don't want to do that and just hit hit it. Yeah. Definitely need more shelf space for these books. As soon as they like pick up a book, they pick up more than one, it's over. Kind of a shame. I really do wish the books would stack. Like, they look pretty on the shelf, but I do wish they would stack actual books and put double the amount on there. I'm so sorry! I'm sorry. Please come back. Take your half dollar. I'm so sorry. Ooh. What other furniture options do we have in here? Just corners. Oh, in this half quad. Just so big. Have a nice day. Maybe I should mark them up even more. These people are buying them. I wonder if there's a guide already online where it's like, if it's this type of item, you can set up by this much over market value. And if you have like this rating or something. Crack book, crack book, da 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 da, crack book. You guys are white. Yeah. 
think I might set those books up by another 50 cents. Whole dollar over market value. do alcohol to you. Dude, this guy came in just for the marked up book. It's like, yes, please. Croc book was out for like literally a millisecond. So I'm ignoring that one. Not too bad, not too bad. I mark up everything by 50 cents. Whoa, Lee, that's enough of that. To be like, I couldn't find the share book because I only got one. One is enough. Okay, I mark up the books in price and everybody wants them more. Yeah, I've never sold so many books in one day. What is happening? That's it. I'm marking him up by a dollar over the market value. Oh wait, this one. This is what you guys get. We're out of paper towels again. I think I'm gonna mark up paper towels too. It's over uh, 1150 1150 it's $10 $11 uh, 8 it's just $2.9 I don't know if they'll like that, but I don't really care. Uh, seven fifty, so eight fifty, six, seven, eleven, so no, there's no way. Eleven fifty was dollar over, and we still sold them, so. Uh, thirteen mm, Ten. No more of this nonsense. You get one of the books. Okay. Let's set alcohol as well. Fifty cents higher.
a lot for one beer bottle, but... Oh yeah, I can't set this price anymore. Um... Yeah, this doesn't let you set it. It used to let you set the bottom one, but you can't anymore, and I don't know how to fix that. Like, I can't do it on... Oh, I can't on these. Hmm. Uh, like, if this ever goes on sale, I'm screwed. I can't do anything about it. Or if it ever goes up in price. Um... Oh, I know what I can do. Take this. We'll put it here for one second. Uh, let's just set it to 50. Pull it back out. Just go ahead and throw this in there for them. Um, hold on, boys. I'm gonna set all these prices. Mark up some of this stuff. And this stuff too. Especially this. Okay. End of day. Only one found expensive. That's not bad. Sandwich bread. Uh, this one? They both say sandwich bread. They both say raw sandwich bread. Which one is it? You got me. I don't know. It's this one. If you pick the other one, you're incorrect. So I need to be resetting these to one. I have done that before. I've accidentally ordered ten or seven or however many will fit in the basket more. Um, okay. Four can fit there. Five, six, seven, eight. Um, yeah, it's fine. So I can move these up there. Get them out the way. Okay. Um. What to do while we wait? Should I increase anything else? Maybe the paper towels? Just because they're selling so much? Just sell them to $19. Go on. I'm going crazy. This is air one. What was I thinking? Um, yeah, that'll work. That'll do. That'll do. Book sale. It's the Amazon book sale. Now where the sale means that they just raise the price. Bad. I ordered the dress book. I totally ordered more of those today. Ah. Just fix this. Huge mistake of mine. I believe I ordered a chicken. If only you could sell things. Oh, wait. <laughs> I just watch Haley Whipjack. She's doing like a. Um, uh, I don't even know what to call the series, but Once Upon a Time like recap or commentary series, where she goes through each season and uh, explains the storyline and comments on it, and she's so good. Her like the way she speaks all of the time isn't always my favorite, but 
I really do like the way she... Her, I agree with a lot of her opinions on the show. And I love her her enthusiasm for the show. Um, she's pretty funny, too. She does full costumes. Although, since she does that, I do kind of have to keep it minimized at work. Because I can just hear my boss being like, Why is she in that stupid costume? Because, like, people aren't allowed to have fun. I can under for it. I think it's so funny that she has, like... I, I can't imagine she has them all at the ready. Like, I'm sure she, like, buys them for those videos. But, like, a couple people I watch on YouTube now. It's kind of funny because she went from TikTok content to, like, two-hour-long videos. So she, like, swing way, swung way the other way. But I'm sure that's also, like, really freeing to just be able to, like, talk about the whole thing and, like, have the space and time to do that. There's only so much you can say in like a three minute sketch. Although I think TikTok videos go up to 10 minutes now. Not my thing, cause like the only place I watch TikTok really, I mean, I can't, I sometimes watch it on my uh, computer. I'm just gonna do that. Computer, but like for the most part, I watch it on my phone, so like, uh, usually if I'm watching TikTok, it's, like, not because I have a couple hours to spare, you know? I can't be watching 10-minute videos. Um, the way I consume TikTok is very much in short spurts. I do need to restart the game before I fail this day. You know how that goes. You guys are dying? Oh, oh, okay. I thought he was stuck. Okay, they are done. So, what did we miss? All right. Let's. Oh, gosh. oh yeah. This reminds me that I need to restart the day or the game. All right. What do you guys think about these boxes? That one. Yeah, okay, okay, I have a plan. We're not falling for it, okay, whatever, we're starting the day. are mostly full. Like, hold, on, hold on, hold on. Let me show you this dog. Oh, you can't see her. Okay, she's such a dumb dog. <laughs> she loves it. She loves that stupid little bone. We probably had that bone for like a bajillion years. I feel like we had it whenever the other dogs were puppies. They always preferred like a... You always get like deer antlers. I always preferred actual bones or like rawhide to like plastic. But this one, I pulled out that stuff because he was eating all of the plastic in the house, which is mostly like remotes and stuff. So it doesn't quite fall apart like a remote, but that's probably a good thing. Let me see. Okay, oh, first customer. Get out of my store, giving four ones. What are you thinking? See how people feel about the books today. So far, they're buying them. They're a dollar over market value. And also the alcohol. Let's see if anybody complains about the alcohol. I don't think anybody's bought alcohol yet. Oh, yeah, she did. Okay. Yes, 
we'll just start charging more. I think we also raise the prices on toilet paper and stuff, so. Maybe people will only buy one instead of like six. We'll just slowly raise the price of everything to a dollar over market value and like people can just deal with it. It's funny because there's like some things like yogurt, they won't even buy it if it's like 10 cents over. Um, but some things are like, ah, it's a dollar over. I wonder if there's a guide. The audacity to send me work after you ignored me all day. It's great. But we don't look at our phone when we're trying to relax and have fun. It's work. He's always right there waiting. Still selling books like crazy. Yeah, I don't really think they care about the elevated price of alcohol in books. It is like a percentage, like 10% over or something like that. Some good money today. Uh, we are out of the croc book. He is on it though. Semi on it. Hold on, let me help him. Yeah, I don't think they're caring about the extra 50 cents on the alcohol either. Which I kind of figured. Uh, or the paper towels and toilet paper. I haven't seen- I haven't really looked in that area, so I don't know if people are complaining about it. People are buying it, so... Well, that really matters. You're going crazy over there? Nobody plays with you all day and then I come home and just play video games? Play Razor Dog Simulator? What was that game? Uh, Nintendo Dogs? Did that? See the chips are down back there. Got it good. I feel like the more I raise the prices, the more they buy the books, so I don't know, man. Crazy. Surprise book. Wish 
kidding. Ah, she ain't too many. Maybe I'll even read some books by a little bit more. I think I could get... Definitely the most individual beer bottles, bottles I've sold in one day. I only went 50 cents over. So I'm wondering if I should go like a dollar over. Be six fifty. Change out food. She found it. Find it right there. I'm gonna raise these to a dollar over the price. Yeah, that's what they're at. And people still want them. I'm just gonna look up a guide. Somebody made a sheet. Are you okay, Sasha? Your butt's itchy? What'd you eat? It's not time yet. We're just waiting for the last few customers. Fifteen to thirty percent increase over the price. It's really one of those things that I haven't put enough time into. I just I feel like we could make a lot more money if I put in the time and effort to raise the prices appropriately. Um two found expensive, which yeah, freaking Two out of 103, that's not bad. Uh, Jusitsu, Green Beans, and Mother Book. Green Beans. It went up. So we're doing a dollar over. So normally I'd set this to 12. Um, honestly, I'll just leave it. I don't know how to do, like, bad at math. Like, you multiply it by, like... How do I do a percentage? So if something is eleven eighty four times twelve times thirty percent, oh my gosh, not point three plus eleven eighty four. So I could theoretically set this to fifteen dollars without anybody complaining. Hey, let her walk out of the room. Um... That seems crazy, but we'll see. We'll see if we sell any. Uh... Just... Cream bean. It also means if we have them that high, we have to reset them every day when their prices change. We just pay attention to that whenever we want to order stuff. Uh... Let's see. And honestly, I had the price is so low because I got sick of people complaining. 
but I'm to the point where I need people to just get over it and buy it. Um, I think I will sell all of these to 30%, because... Uh, let's do 1870, it's fine. I would like to get the most profit out of the things that give us, take the most labor. 1838? This one, somewhere, no, it wasn't, okay. Four? Maybe. Ah! 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 Um, yeah. Oh. Maybe this stuff to you. Hmm. Maybe I go through and I set everything to 30% the market value. Uh, after the stream. We'll see how many people complain with just like... Because yeah, I have this stuff set to 30% and this one book. And then I've marked up some of the alcohol. We'll see. We'll go from there. All right. Bills. Um, what was on sale? Soda. No, I don't need that. Uh, book. So I would like to get ten of those. Make my life easier. And green beans. Alright. I mean, we still sold just as much as we do every day, so... I don't think it's that big of a deal. I don't think we have... St oh, we do have more storage room, too. Hmm. I think the only other achievement is for buying all of the expansions, which kind of sucks. Um, instead of all of the... Let me start this... Um, buying all of the licenses, which you would think would be more compelling, but I guess it's more spent time and money if you buy all the expansions, because they definitely cost a lot more than all the licenses do, but we'll get there. Okay, guys, there's a box on the floor. There's several boxes in the store. I'm going to go ahead. I don't want to open yet. Because it looks like they're all busy doing something. This means that they didn't finish restocking. They lied to me. They lied. Anyway. So I, I signed up for a Tunnel Vision. Like, they have uh, their clothing brand. But they're doing, like, a, once a month you get jewelry. It's like $12 a month and you get a piece of jewelry. Um, this month is this bracelet. Just really, I don't know how well you guys can see that. Really simple and actually really cute. I don't know. Oh, here it is. So I was like, I don't know how I put it on. It's not very big, but I kind of like that to be fair. Because I have like a chain bracelet, but it's like... I like that it's chunky, like it's a chunky chain, but it's so like loose. Alright. Yeah. That's cute. I actually really like that. I never get to wear metal very often because like, I, don't, I just don't have metal bracelets. Like I never think to buy bracelets. So, it's one of those things that I want to buy more of. They were not near done with stocking. They just, like, gave up. They were just like, no. Nah. Like, look at this. This is not stocked at all. You guys made me look bad. I was like, oh, God, I got to catch back up. I think maybe tabbing in and out of the game might be the problem. Well, we're going to hit level 88 today, so that's an achievement. Um, we're definitely not going to get the money for the license, but that's okay. Uh, yeah, we're only halfway there. Halfway there. We could, no, we're not even close to getting that either. Let's see, two cakes, a chocolate bar, chocolate powder, sugar, and yogurt. So, let's see. The yogurt we definitely have space for. Not that we need more yogurt. The sugar... I think I was just going to put here. 
uh, depending on either here or here. Sugar. Uh, chocolate powder? That one's a bit random. I don't know where... I guess I could put it on this shelf. I guess I could put that in now, right? Since it's our waiting anyway. Um, I could put it on this shelf because I don't have anything specifically to go here. I just want to fill in this gap. Yeah, that looks good. See, this this is like the same size as that giant four, that like quad thing, but holds so much more product. It holds uh, eight more spaces worth of product. So, you know, just do this. Um, I mean, technically counts as four pieces of furniture, but whatever. Okay, so we have yogurt that can go there. The chocolate powder can go there. Sugar can go there also. If I want to expand the sugar, I can just do that too. Because, like, um, I can move... Let's see, I can move this here, this here, uh, one of the sugars there, and then... Two susu, two susu. Like, have the susu there and the susu there. And then that's Darren, that's Darren, that's Pablo. I could do that, but then I wouldn't have any pro space for the chocolate powder I was literally just talking about. Um, so anyway, chocolate powder can go there. So then we have another cake and another chocolate bar. I don't really have space for those. I don't know where I want to put those. I could bring this out a little if I wanted to. I don't know what I would do with that, but... Um, I mean, since it's chocolate, I could put it there. I just kind of have, like, all the candy and cakes over here. Um, and it's just too much for this one shelf. And what else do we need? Two cakes. Yeah, two cakes. Chocolate bar and chocolate bar. So I have three extra, like, food items. I guess I could just honestly move the books off of here and put them somewhere else. I just don't have the space to put the books in. So, yeah. I need more space. Our next our next big purchase is going to have to be space cuz I need to move these books and I need to this this I feel like this takes up more space than it needs to take up. But I don't have anywhere to put it to take up less space. Um but I feel like even one cube of expansion could be the solution cuz then we can push the fridges back even behind these shelves. And then have all the freezers back there too. And then it's just like the cold area. And then we could have all the books over here. And then we could have all the cakes here. And then chocolate spread or powder, cocoa powder there. That's what it's called. I don't know what it's called. Chocolate cocoa powder. Um, yogurt's in the fridge. Sugar also over there. It's really fine. Ah, cakes in the chocolate bar. And then maybe we could even spread out the books too. Because, like, if I get two shelves, is that enough? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. That's two shelves. So I need. I have eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve books. So one, two, three, four. It's one shelf. So I need three shelves for books. That's not bad. That'll make this area look complete, though. Because then I can put a shelf there and then two here. And then... I guess there would be nothing in this middle area. But I could get... Like, small shelves, maybe? Like a display? Or I could just put these in there. Just two. That way it looks a little bit more cohesive. Because I also could get another pop fridge because um, we don't have all of them in there. I think we hold, need a whole nother fridge worth. They're also just spares. They're literally just spares of decoration, so it is whatever. Potentially, though, I could 
get the shorter shelves and put all the cakes on the shorter shelves. So, because that's like only half a shelf, um, I just get rid of all three of these shelves, buy the shorter version of it, and then that's enough space for all the chocolate and cake. I don't know what the last license is. Oh, it's alcohol. Yeah, we're definitely going to have to expand for alcohol too, because I'm full up on alcohol space. I'm over full on alcohol space. Actually, I've limited it more than I would have. They did not restock at all. I've been talking this whole time, and they're still not restocked. Also, I'm going to completely forget that plan by the time we get there anyway, so whatever. I'm just, like, putting it out into the universe so that whenever I go, how are we going to do this? And then it, like, just, like, comes back to me, you know? It's the hopes and the dreams. Doesn't mean I'm probably going to have to order more, though. Took their sweet dime. Yeah, if I didn't need that space for anything, I could literally just fill in all of this sugar because I have one, two, three, four, five, six. That's four and that's six. Too bad we're getting more. It's not. We need another sugar. Like, I mean, six different types of sugar. It's not nearly enough. Dog break. Waiting for them to restock anyway. Dog break. Oh, all you see is the dog butt. Dog butt break. Yes. Oh, yes. The way she's sitting on this this pillow is so funny to me. Hey, come here. Get out of the way so the people can see. Look at that. Look how she's sitting on that. It's so funny. Dog break. Dog break. Oh, yes. Hope she's gonna steal your spot. Oh, you have so much fur on you. Oh! Eat it, Sasha. <laughs> Get that ball. Get that ball. <laughs> oh, don't put it under the furniture. Okay, you got it. There you go. <laughs> She found it. You got it. Oop. She has so many toys in here, she keeps tripping over them. Hi, what are you doing? Oh, hurt you. You ready? Break. Oh, looks like they're finally done. Let's do. Let's look at the damage here. It looks like we're gonna need that chicken. I thought it was doing so good on money too. I was like, man, we haven't we haven't had to order anything. We're just we're just buying everything anymore. Who knows what we actually need? My employees certainly don't know what they're doing. We're ready to start the day now. You guys gonna actually do your jobs today, or is this gonna be another, like, we're not doing work because we're lazy, lie about, I can think of another L word, <laughs> lazy louses. There's a lot of people on the street, so I'm gonna wait a minute. Okay. Let's go. Register, boys, are you ready? No rumble. I'm going to need my suit over here. I'll have some over here. There we go. We're almost through the Masuka. It's crazy. We'll refill a shelf or something. I know you guys got better things to do than to like babysit me putting stuff on a shelf. 
believe it. Oh. A customer for me? Let's see if anybody buys a... I'm barked up by 30% toilet paper today. We shall see. I don't know if I'm a mixed metal person. I am definitely, never mind. Just realized my necklaces are different metals. Yeah. Okay, paper towels are too expensive. Um, let's do twenty three fifty. I did think I, I think I put those a little bit over. Okay, something else. Just, that's probably nice. Let's We gotta see if they buy the mother book, because that's the one's 30% mock up markup. She's just sitting down. Let her sit down. You gotta check my real paper situation. So this is too expensive. Um, let's do 19. Okay, let's do 18. This is back here. This is Air One toilet paper, people. Don't forget it. Okay, he's buying paper towels. So that's fine now. She needs to see somebody buy. Whoa. Yeah, well, other people are buying it, okay? Anybody buying toilet paper? You guys see any toilet paper sold? Mine's probably full, my bad. Those boxes were different sizes. Let's get to see how the toilet paper's doing. Anybody buying toilet paper? This toilet paper's too expensive. Uh, okay. I think this one. Still too expensive. Uh, let's do eighteen fifty. Yeah. Deal with my lines here. The line over there is getting long. So let me make sure people are buying the mother book. So 30% is probably a little too high, but I'm thinking 15 we might get away with. Look at the cash, it always goes much faster. Uh, 
Everybody's like, you can't buy toilet paper, I'll just buy wipes. Somebody did buy toilet paper though, so... I'm closer to that margin. Let me go look at this. People are buying it. The ale. This bottle of water? This one? This one. Frick off. You're cheap. Based. People see people complain about prices and then suddenly they want to complain about them all. People are buying toilet paper. People are buying the mother book. Just the percentage of people. Like, 80% of people are buying it. So we probably offset the cost. And maybe... They'll make a profit? If only like 50% of people are buying it, then we're at a net loss, eventually. are buying them though so it's good we will buy less at a time i got the spaghetti mm. if most people aren't buying it though is it really a net gain like i guess at, when you do sell it it's at a higher profit margin but it says it's on a shelf longer. I don't know if that's better. I did not see any mother books, but apparently some people did buy them. I'm buying the croc book. Probably ran out, to be fair. Hmm. I don't know. I did complain about the alcohol, though. I do wish it would tell you what your people complain about. Instead of having to catch them while they're in the store. How many of those we sold? Maybe like a box. Well, not too bad, actually. Yeah, I think uh, what I'll do is go through and mark up all the prices by 15%. Um, and then maybe a few things by 20 Just to get away with it. Because I think this is now closer to 20 Let's see. Hold on. 18.38 times 20. Oops, nope. Uh, 25, I guess, yeah. Tomorrow, Air One truly opens. 105 customers, 28 found too expensive. See, at that point, I don't think we're making any money. Apple juice, chocolate ice cream, and salmon. Mm. 
four. I'm going to set everything up anyway, so it doesn't really matter. Apple juice, chocolate ice cream, and salmon. Okay, not too bad. Tomorrow, I think we... Or, not tomorrow. The next time we play, um, I'll go through and set all the prices up. And then we will truly, truly be Air One. At, I mean, 15% markup is not that crazy. Oh, crazy. It's a little crazier than either at or below market value that I've been doing, so we'll see. All right. Well, I'm not going to make you guys sit here and watch them because I'm probably going to have to restart anyway because they just decide to stop working most of the time. But that's it for today. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you guys back here next time.